am I here with today? Hi, my name's Althea Freeman Miller. Hope Federowitz. And what's your internship position and who are you working with? I'm doing an internship for Althea Designs with a focus on um, creative retail. What do you do at Althea Designs? Do you want to tell me a little bit more about your business? I'm an artist. I'm a printmaker mostly, so I specialize in linoleum block printing and I do some wood block prints, painted wood cutouts. I have a studio that has a gallery space and um, I do the craft shows, Chilmark Flea Market and the Eggertown Village Market. What is your day to day or week like as an intern? What tasks do you often have? So I normally come in here on Mondays and Fridays and a lot of what I do is helping package things and organize things and sometimes I'll come with Althea to First Friday with her and the Chilmark Flea Market once so that was also something that I do. How long have you been doing this for? I think I've been selling prints for 14 years. Have you had like an artist mentor or somebody who's kind of served as like a role model in you know the development of your business and becoming an artist who's actually you know selling your artwork yeah I think I've been just surrounded by them my parents both artists just our community <laughs> and my friend group mostly is either people you know people own their own businesses or and make arts how has Althea supported your learning and development during your internship? She's given me really helpful feedback. I was designing business cards and trying to kind of figure out what to put on them. She gave me a lot of ideas and how to make them more simple or make them more informative. And she's also just been really supportive in my own journey and letting me come to her shows, letting me sell my stuff um, underneath her tents. So she's just been, yeah, really supportive. I'm curious what sort of an impact have these mentors had on you and how has it helped you on your journey um, to get to where you are now? Working in community really and um, just holding space to, to watch me and like encourage me and buy my art and that it feels like a natural way of life to make art and share it. What soft skills are you hoping to develop during this internship or just skills in general? Um, I think going back to how genuine Althea is, I want to be kind of a more people person and really welcoming. And I guess just working on having drive and motivation because sometimes I get a little burnt out with my art. <laughs> What elements from those mentorship experiences are you carrying into your internship program? Just to create an inspiring space where I hope that Hope feels um, comfortable to be herself and just to like want to be here. Like just a friend. I just, you know, I want to be an inspiration. I want her to see that she can do whatever, the, whatever she wants. <laughs> Based on your experience so far, what would you say is the value of doing an internship as a young professional? It gives you a lot of experience and I think that for me especially um, this was good to do because it's almost like a test run to make sure like this is the path that I want to go on and so far I think it is the path that I want to go on. What would you say has been the most helpful part about having an intern so far? I think it helps me show up. A lot of it is like the accountability, like helps me show up and make my space. Feeling like I'm getting set up for hope to come in is also the way I want to be set up for myself to come in. Also just helps me get stuff done. Like the, the little things that she does and then her attention to detail and her like really caring and like showing up and you know, it's really, it's, it's awesome because I work for myself. So when I get this opportunity to feel like I have like a team and we're a team, it's awesome. But yeah, actually packaging prints and like offering to get me a coffee or like you know that we get to giggle about something or like realize we both like the same song like that kind of stuff when you work for yourself is like you know what have you found to be most interesting about your internship so far what do you like best about it i think that i've thought it's really interesting kind of observing althea and her really um genuine customer service she cares about the people that come in here she cares about the people she works with for me, I've always tried to create to appeal to other people and I've noticed that Althea creates for herself and a lot of what she does is from the heart, so that's really inspiring to me. So in the process of selecting an intern when you were getting applications, 
What were some of the key qualities that you were looking for in an intern? I think it's really like just when you're meeting a human, just like, you know, how it feels and, um, you know, how, how much it's actually going to work in their life for it to fit in and how available they are and um, like the timing. The interview process was really interesting to see, you know, where people are at and where and just have it feel really like free and open to be like, you know, what, it, what do you need in your life right now and like what are you really looking for and then, you know, letting people, give people enough space to sort of like figure that out while we're in the internship too, you know? What are some of the skills and takeaways that you hope that your intern will walk away with from this internship experience? Yeah, mostly to be empowered and confident to know that she can make, you know, her life the way she wants it to be in the little details of, and still be you know, that sort of like balance of like, we're getting a job done, but we're gonna have fun and enjoy our life and be like silly and serious at the same time. <laughs> and can you describe a project or something you have learned during your internship that has changed your perspective on things and how you will work in the future? Kind of helping Althea with her packaging and stuff and how she runs this place. I've learned that you don't need to try and create to please someone else. You want kind of making yourself happy with your art. I'm wondering what made you interested in becoming one of the camp employers during this pilot uh, program? Like an artist or a craftsperson or someone who might not be so academic and all the internships always being so it's like school focused, there'd be more opportunity for people to learn crafts and the island is such a good supportive place for that to happen it just needed needs like the organization and that they could all look really different ways what about the camp internship program caught your attention like Althea I'm a very artistic person I'm in the process of starting my own business so when I saw um, the camp internship program available where there was a focus on creative retail I found out or I figured out that that was kind of couldn't have come at a better time because um, it really lines up with what I'm doing right now. I'm wondering what do you think is the value of the camp program for the island community? I think that like school and <laughs> the community can sometimes be so separate and I just feel like camp is like bringing us together in a really um, like refreshing <laughs> way. What do you appreciate the most about the camp program beyond your direct internship with your employer? I think it's really great that it offers so many opportunities to young professionals and people who want to get more experience in certain fields and I think that that's really valuable because especially when you're younger you can take that with you into the rest of your life and like your adulthood. Would you recommend the camp program for other employers? Yes. Definitely. <laughs> yeah. And it, I mean, it's really helpful to, to get connected to someone, but also to have someone support you through, like, you know, learning how to have employees or how to have interns, too. So, how has this internship experience affected your future career aspirations? It's definitely offered me a lot of insight and experience because it's very um, similar to what I want to do and pursue in my life. Do you have any advice for young professionals on the island who are still kind of figuring out what exactly it is that they want to do or offer to our community? It would be to just keep trying things and then let, let it also be okay if you're like, wait, I don't like it. Like, it's okay to not like things. I think I spent like a lot of, like probably all of my 20s just learning what I don't want to do. And that's really good information. And do you have any like tips or recommendations for other interns that are like applying in the future? I think definitely try to apply for something that you think you'll love and that you'll be interested in. Um, don't just go do an internship because it's available and you might, like maybe it's a paid internship and you're just like, let me do this so I can get that money. Like definitely try and pursue something that you think you might be passionate about. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to have this conversation and being one of our camp employers. <laughs> Thanks for having me. <laughs> yeah, thank you for having me. Yeah.